Getting your video binge or just simply work on a huge TV screen is tremendously awesome. But sometimes, the process can be daunting, right? In today's video, I will guide you through screen mirroring by using the AirPlay features on both Roku TV and Roku players. So stay tight, I will navigate you through any challenges you may encounter in your process. Before getting started, make sure you have given us a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button for further tips and tricks. Alright, first thing first, let's get our Roku TV. From this home screen, head to settings and tap on Apple AirPlay and HomeKit. Here, you gotta make sure AirPlay switch is on. You see two options, on and off, just like a light switch. Now, here's the thing that's usually ignored, this requiring code option. If you choose first time only, your iPhone will ask for a pairing code just once, then no code is needed for this TV. If you hit every time, it's like asking for a 90 each time, more secure, but it's gotta be more step too. And, since you want to have an extra layer of security, you can even set a password for AirPlay. For our guide here, I'm going with every time, just to show you how it works for each step of the way. Well, those are enough for basics. But we still have two options down there to tweak, like subtitles and captioning. Handy if you want to customize your viewing experience. Next up, let's talk about Wi-Fi. If your TV and iPhone need to be on the same Wi-Fi network, I'm using point and click of 5GHz VN for both. Just make sure they match. Now, let's get onto your iPhone. Swipe down to open control center and tap that screen mirroring icon. Look for your Roku TV in the list. For me, it's my TCL Roku TV. Tap on our TV and a code should pop up on your TV screen. Enter this code on your iPhone and you're connected. You can do the same process to pair your MacBook or iPad with this Roku TV. Just make sure you follow exactly the steps that we just walked through. If you've been following us from the beginning up to this point, I would say it's just much easier for you to know doing the same thing with Roku players. You gotta just power on the Roku player probably and then plug it in your TV. Let's say HDMI 1. After that, just follow the steps in the settings and turn on the airplay. Then pick your required code preference. But yeah, you gotta make sure your Wi-Fi networks match. Then just choose Roku Ultra when you screen mirroring from your iPhone. Enter the code and you are set. Now, if you hit a snack and can airplay, don't sweat it. Check that your TV and iPhone are on the same Wi-Fi network. If you're using mesh Wi-Fi, try switching a different network. I've been there, it can be tricky. Sometimes, giving your TV and iPhone a quick restart can fix 90% of the issues. Also, keep your Roku updated. Head to Settings, and then System, and Software Update to make sure you've got the latest and greatest. That's our guide. So you've got Roku device in your place, I bet you don't want to miss these two videos right here. Let's give it a shot and again, thanks for tuning in, catch you in the next one.